Hello, today I'm going to show you how to control a DC motor by microbit using a transistor, which you can see over here. And let me explain it with the circuit diagram. As you can see, we have to sign 3V or what can also be called 3 volts. And it's sending 3 volts of of current through this wire and into the transistor or to be specific the collector uh, leg of the transistor we also have this sign one or what can also be called pin one which you can which is in the micro bit and it sends a small amount of electricity through this wire into another leg called the base leg of the transistor and when it sends this electricity then it lets the three volts pass through from this end to the from the collector to the emitter and then the electricity travels around into the motor sign and it will go and into the ground or zero V. Let me show you it working. We're controlling it to work for two seconds and then stop for two seconds. We're doing this by manipulating how the electricity is flowing through using the digital right pin block. In this forever loop, we're using digital right pin P1 to zero. This means we aren't giving the pin one in the micro bit electricity to go through to the wire and let the three volts go through so that's why our motor stops and then we wait for 2000 milliseconds or two seconds and then we write digital write pin p1 to one that means we're giving it some electricity now and which means our motor will start working and then another two seconds and this will keep on repeating on Now I'm going to show you it's working again. One and two. And you can see how it is making our fan move every two seconds. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Bye.